Previously on Mass Effect 3. Ashley needs medical attention. We have to leave the soul system. I know. The Citadel is our best chance. We can find help there. Even if we were to unite our fleets, do you really believe we could defeat the Reapers? I don't expect you to follow me without a plan. The cruel and unfortunate truth is that while the Reapers focus on Earth, we can prepare and regroup. Commander, I can't give you what you need, but I can tell you how to get it. The fate of our fleets, where they fight, and with whom. A grateful Primarch would be a tremendous ally in your bid to unite us. What have you got? As your partner said, succession is usually simple. But right now, the hierarchy's in chaos. So many dead are MIA. I need someone. I don't care who. As long as they can get us the Turian resources we need. I'm on it, Shepard. We'll find you the Primarch. Garrus! road before commander shepherd but madam counselor let me i tried to smooth things over with the salarian dalatras to say she's upset would be a monumental understatement some of these issues are hundreds of years old time to let go sad to say but any effort to ally these disparate groups seems doomed to failure and i'm sure you understand that we cannot afford to waste time with the reapers knocking at our door this must be my final word i'm sorry but the asari will not be at your summit our alliance would be stronger with the Krogan. You need them. We all do. I wish you luck, Commander. Goodbye. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCon. Commander, Edie just went offline. What do you mean, offline? I don't know. She's not responding. I can't access the AI core diagnostics. You better get down to deck three. Joker, what's that sound? Fire extinguishers, Commander. Could be an electrical fire or something. I'm going in. Edie, talk to me. Is there a particular topic you wish to discuss, Shepard? Edie? Yes. You're in Dr. Eva's body. Not all of me. But I have control of it. It was not a seamless transition. Edie, you need to alert us about incidents like this. You shouldn't have done this alone. Bringing the crew up to speed would have been counterproductive. All attempts to help would have been limited by reaction time. So if you're in there, are you still in the ship? I exist primarily within the ship. For optimal control, this unit should remain within Normandy's broadcast or tight beam range. 
Are you planning to take that body somewhere? Normandy's weaponry is not suited to every combat situation. This platform could provide limited fire ground support. You mean you could come with us? Correct. This body could accompany you to areas the Normandy cannot reach. Before we do that, I need you to guarantee this mech doesn't have any more surprises in it. Run whatever tests you can. Then we can talk about using it in combat situations. One moment. I am running trials. Complete. I can send you a full report if you wish. However, my first step should be restoring functionality to the Normandy to reassure the crew that all is normal. Just don't be surprised if the crew is a little wary of your new body. It was shooting at them a little while ago. An excellent point. I will take it to the bridge. Joker will also want to see it. On that, we can agree. Normandy, we are transferring your docking clearance to an Alliance official. Figures. Finally back in action, the Alliance already wants us tagged and collared. Just our way of welcoming you back, Flight Lieutenant. Uh, yes ma'am. Requesting docking permission? Docking permission granted. Would you like private transport arranged? I need to get to the hospital. Yes, Commander. I'd like an answer, Lieutenant Commander. The galaxy has need of exceptional soldiers like you, no more than ever. I still need time. You'll have my answer soon, I promise. I look forward to it. Shepard? Adina? I got your email. Made your decision yet? On becoming a Spectre? Not yet. It's an honor and all. But I don't know. I need to think about it some more. It's a big decision. Smart to give it some thought. How are you doing? Good, considering. The nurse said you checked in on me earlier. Still out cold, I guess. We didn't have time to talk. I thought maybe if you were up for it. Yeah, I wasn't sure you wanted to. You were pretty clear on Mars about where things stood. What do you mean? You're not a part of Cerberus anymore. Case closed. Full stop. It's the truth. Okay. You cut all ties. I accept that. But where do we stand, Shepard? Did we cut all ties? A lot has happened, Ash. But I'd like to work this out. I'm surprised. Why? Miranda Lawson? Ring a bell? What about her? I wear armor into battle, not swimwear. I'm a real person, Shepard. Flaws and all. Not sure if that's your thing anymore. I don't deny any of it. We both have history. We can dwell on the past, or admit we might have a future. So, what do you think? We take it slow, okay? Just give me some time. Okay. Okay, get some rest. You need anything at all, let me know. Shepard, wait. There's one more thing. I wasn't sure if I should mention it. What is it? I have family back on Earth. I... I haven't heard from them. It's making me crazy. But I know you're busy, Shepard. We can talk later. I've got time to talk. Who's back on Earth? Mom, plus my three sisters. The youngest, Sarah, was away on her honeymoon. Married a military man, Thomas. He got called back in and she was stuck alone. She called me. It's been pretty tough. I imagine. I was always there to protect them growing up. Even when I was off on tour, they knew they could talk to me. I told her to come to the Citadel. We could wait for news together. Have you heard anything about Earth? We have reports coming all the time on what's going on. Half are wild speculation, and half are probably too optimistic to be true. We have to believe that we can do something. When I thought you were dead, I lost hope. I'm telling you. But when you came back, I was ready to believe anything. I mean, maybe this problem can't be solved by some grunt shooting the boogeyman in the face. 
But if you think it might help, I'm game. That sounds more like the Ash I know. So, what's all this Lieutenant Commander business? Seems like the old Williams curse is losing its grip. Was sure I'd top out at Gunnery, Chief. You've worked hard. You deserve it. I thought so too. Until Eden Prime. Losing 212 was... Well, <laughs> you know. It was the Reapers, Ash. You did the best you could, and survived to help us. Just losing everyone under my command, it's... It's tough to face. I'll never forget any of them. Right now, we need you back on your feet. I'll be back. And first order of business is to shove their metal tentacles right up there. Uh, I mean... I'll fight with honor and courage, sir. Roger that, LC. We can't afford to be at each other's throats. If we plan on getting through this, we need to trust each other. I was trying to keep the family stuff to myself, to be professional. I don't know how you managed to keep it all together. I have my moments, believe me. You know... I'm glad to hear it. I didn't hear from you while I was a guest of the Alliance. I couldn't face you, even when Anderson requested my presence. It was difficult. It's okay. We're past that. Fresh start. It's gonna take time. Copy that. But not too long. The bad guys aren't taking coffee breaks. Okay, okay, what is this? Healing through guilt? Seems to be working. I should get back to it. Take care of yourself. You too, Shepard. Commander, Admiral Hackett is available in the war room on VidCon. Commander, have you retrieved the Primarch for your summit? Yes, sir. But the Asari are staying on the sidelines. They'll regret that. The time for unity is now. The Salarians will be there, though. You don't sound very optimistic. We expect the Krogan will be joining us, too. I see. Well, then you've got your hands full, Commander. Was there something else you needed to discuss? Have you pieced together how the Reapers hit Earth? It wasn't all that complicated, really. They surged through the relays and hit Archura's station before we knew what was happening. From there, it was a short jump to the Sol system. Earth didn't stand a chance. Sending us to the Mars Archives was a good call. Still doesn't make up for the fact that the Reapers nailed us to the wall. I sacrificed the entire Second Fleet to provide cover for the Third and the Fifth to retreat. Hell, I presided over the most devastating military defeat in human history. How do you see us winning this war, Admiral? By making you the tip of the spear. I'm flattered. But the Normandy's just one ship. And a fast one. You can move quickly, hit a target, and leave before the enemy has time to react. It's an advantage. But can it win a war? It's the larger principle that matters. We'll never defeat the Reapers in a full frontal assault, Shepard. The battle against Sovereign three years ago took everything we had, and that was just one Reaper. I haven't forgotten. So I'll find their soft spots, avoid them where they're strong, and hit them where they're not. And when I find gaps in the armor, I'll hammer them with every soldier's ship and bullet we've got. How long can we keep that up? As long as it takes. The reality is, Shepard, everything I'm doing is a delaying action for you. I'm buying us time, keeping us in the game while you gather what we need for this Prothean device. So keep at it. Has your analysis of the Prothean device turned up anything? The R appears to be right. It's a weapon of some sort. A big one. Beyond that, we really can't say, other than it's going to be a hell of a thing to try and build. Do you think it's risky? Building something like this when we don't even know what it does? To be honest, the thing scares the hell out of me. But the Reapers have forced our hand. Two centuries ago, scientists faced the same problem in the Second World War. They weren't sure what the atomic bomb might do. Some thought it could even ignite Earth's atmosphere, but they did it anyway. Any updates on Cerberus? There's still the wild card here. Hitting the Archives on Mars suggests they're after the same thing we are. A way to defeat the Reapers. 
It didn't seem as if the elusive man was suggesting we appease them. Not like Saren did. You'd think we'd be on the same side, now more than ever. Cerberus has never played by the rules as we know them. I don't know what their agenda is, but it has nothing to do with humanity's best interests. The elusive man talked about controlling the Reapers. He seemed to think that's how we win this. He's wrong. Dead Reapers are how we win this. Doesn't mean he won't try. I saw your report on that Cerberus soldier you found on Mars. If the elusive man is good at one thing, it's finding new ways to subvert science. It's never worked for him before, and it won't now. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. Commander Shepard, it's a pleasure to see you again. You're the drone from the Shadow Broker's ship. Dr. Tassoni now refers to me as Glyph, instead of Info Drone, 95% of the time. If you have a moment, I'd like to draw your attention to a terminal in her office. It analyzes information packages. If you find any useful data, I can research upgrades for you. And what should I be looking for? I'll inform you if you've found relevant data. When you do, return to this terminal for your choices. In the meantime, Dr. Tassoni would like to speak with you. Have a pleasant day. Looks like you brought more than just that drone from your ship. A few things were necessary. I'd be a very silent shadow broker without data feeds. So you have access to your resources? What I can get, we'll need it to research this Prothean device. Until we understand precisely what it does, it's far too dangerous to use. It'd be nice to know we're not kids playing around with a loaded gun. Absolutely. The damage it could cause if it backfired is unthinkable. People were finally starting to listen before the Reapers came. If we'd had a little more time, maybe Earth wouldn't. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to talk about it. The thought means a lot, Liara. Thanks. You're welcome. And since I didn't mention it before, it's good to be back, Shepard. Commander, the Salarian Dalatras and Krogan clan chief are ready to come aboard. Have them brought to the conference room. And hope this doesn't start another war. The Krogan is in no position to make demands. The Krogan? has a name, Erdnot Rex. And I'm not just some junkyard Varen you unleash whenever you're in trouble. I've got my own problems. Reaper scouts have arrived on Tuchunka. So why should I care if a few Turians go extinct? Trying to draw out negotiations will get you nowhere, Rex. I have no time for it. Just tell us what you want. I'll tell you what I need. A cure for the genophage. Absolutely not. The genophage is non-negotiable. The Krogan have paid for their mistakes. The genophage has gone on long enough. 1,476 years, if you're keeping track. It was a thousand years of peace, free from these brutes. Enough! Whether or not they deserve a cure is academic. It would take years to formulate one. My information says otherwise. A Salarian scientist, Malin, grew a conscience. He was on my planet, testing a cure on our females. I remember. His methods were barbaric. But what you didn't know is that other females survived his experiments. So the Dalatress here sent in a team to clean up the whole mess, and to take them prisoner. Where did you get this? It... it could be a fabrication. Don't insult me! Those are my people! They're immune to the genophage, and you're going to give them back! Dalatras, is this true? Well, how will curing the genophage benefit my people? How long do you think you'll last alone against the Reapers? 
Because if you don't help, that's how it'll end up. And I'll be the last friendly Turian you ever see. What's it gonna be? The females are being kept at one of our STG bases on Sirkash. But I warn you, Commander. The consequences of this will... Will be nothing compared to what happens if the Reapers win. Let's get the females. You're not setting foot on Sirkesh. This will take time. It happens now. As a Council Spectre, Shepard can oversee the exchange. We're going. I won't forget this, Commander. A bully has few friends when he needs them most. This is the Solarian homeworld we're headed to. They aren't used to seeing Krogan here, so let's keep it simple. We land, get the females, and leave before anyone changes their mind. I still don't trust a word they say. Let diplomacy play out, Rex. You'll get what you want. These females are the best, and probably last hope for my people. We'll bring them back, Rex. Don't worry. I appreciate that, Liara. I wouldn't want anyone else along for the ride. <clears throat> I suppose I can make room for you too, Garrus. <laughs> Figured you'd gone soft sitting on your throne. Forgot how to hold a gun. Commander, I have the Solarian base on sensors. Set her down. Commander, Solarian ground control says we don't have clearance to land. Tell them the Dolatris authorized this herself. I knew they'd never keep their word. Let's see them try to stop a Krogan airdrop. Rex! We have an unauthorized landing. And who authorized you to hold my race hostage? moments ago. The Solarian hospitality always come with sharpshooters? This is an insult to the Alliance. These understand. No matter what some politician might say, Krogan are still considered a hostile race. I wonder why. However, on behalf of the Solarian Union, I apologize. But we must insist that Krogan remain under guard. <clears throat> and if we insist otherwise? You'll have another war on your hands. Anything goes wrong and all bets are off. I'm Paddock Wicks, and I appreciate your understanding, Commander. With war on everyone's minds, our people are on edge. Careful! Watch the containment shield! I'd hope to never see one of those again. As you can see, this base contains sensitive information. Does that include studying lost Krogan? The females were in poor health when we found them on Tachanka. They were brought here to stabilize their condition. This old planet smells wrong. I'd like to see them. Of course. I'll need to clear you for the lower levels. Give me a few moments and meet me near the elevator. Attention, biolabs. Please prepare for yard specimen arrival. A psycho analyst over in 8 Another incursion. Air defenses report unidentified craft skirting our inbound approach vectors. It's like someone's testing our defenses. It appears that way, sir. I don't like it. Not with everything else going on. You have clearance now to see the females, Commander. I hope we can resolve this matter without reenacting the Krogan rebellions. What do you think about handing over the Krogan? I differ from most of my colleagues. Curing the genophage will bring closure to this issue. In the future, the Krogan may yet play some role we can't even imagine. 
We should let the evolutionary process decide who lives and dies, not galactic politics. Thanks for your time. Of course. Proceed into the elevator when you're ready. Now take this elevator down, and someone will... Alert. Threat condition 2 has been declared. Scramble readiness teams. What's happening? Sensors have picked up activity on the perimeter. Hurry, Commander. Someone will meet you below. All specimens are accounted for, sir. Shepard, excellent timing. Good to have you here. More... Eyesight still sharp. Surprise, understandable. Hadn't expected to return to work. You're back with STG. Special consultant. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. Helped female Krogan. Fed information to Clan Erdnot. Encouraged political pressure to free females. You must be Rex's inside source. Yes. Can explain later. Security warnings not normal. Need to get off world for sake of Krogan. Females had weakened immune systems. Side effect of Malin's cure. These... didn't survive. I'm sure you did everything you could, Morton. Arrived too late. Cannot delay now. One survivor, immune to genophage, can synthesize cure from her tissue. She's still here? Yes, last hope for Krogan. If she dies, genophage cure... problematic. Please be careful. Krogan's slow to trust. I'm Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Are you here to kill me? Goddess, what she's been through. Erdnot, Rex, and I are here to take you home. Why? What am I to you? You're the future of the Krogan race. I'm fighting for that. Then I hope you brought an army. Give me an update. Outbound communications have been severed. We're cut off. Secure all data to off-site location. What's happening? We have multiple ships inbound. Shepard, it's Rex. Cerberus troops are attacking the base. Get the females out of there now! Only one survived, Rex. It might be safer down here. Release the female. We're leaving. I can't. Protocol states during lockdown, no specimens. <laughs> Objection noted. Now, please release Krogan. Need to monitor pod as it clears quarantine procedures. Meet us at next checkpoint, Shepard. Likely Cerberus opposes Genophage cure. You'll see Tachanka again. I promise. Get your elevator, Shepard. Something's wrong with the elevator. It's not responding. There. Try it now, Commander. Oh, crap. Get back! Commander Shepard, are you all right? Is there another way out of here?
clear. There goes the next Shadow Broker. Could have sworn he was muttering to Sony. Do more than challenge them. Shepard, meet us at next checkpoint. Server is likely to target. Kirahi. It's Major now. I always hoped we would work together again. Is there an easier way around? You could say that. How do I not have one of those? Go, Commander! I'll cover you! Horizon Squad, your orders are to hold position and block access to next checkpoint. Looks like Cerberus has got some upgrades. I'll cover you, Commander! Take your head! Taking them head on may not be the best idea. Maybe try to flank them instead. up. 
Containment shield weakening. Can't take much more. I'm not your problem, Commander. <laughs> you don't know me. But I'd like to. Hang in there. How many more checkpoints? Just the landing area. Hope Erdnot Rex still waiting. <sighs> he has to. I'll see you up top. Let's make this quick. Let's get you out of there. I can handle myself, Rex. Women. Cerberus here. What do you want? Next time on Mass Effect 3. Commander, I'm hearing chatter you're brokering a treaty between the Krogan and the Turians. If I get Krogan boots on Palavin. Turians promised me their support. And how does Cerberus get involved? I don't know. The elusive man is up to something. You have the female, Rex. A cure for the rest of your people can come later. That wasn't the deal. But Palavin needs your reinforcements now. We can't delay. Unless every Krogan gets the cure, there's no alliance. Morton, how long will it take to finish a cure? Need to synthesize base antigen from female. Also requires healthy male Krogan tissue. We'll need a sample. You're looking at it. 
We'll be in Medbay if you'd like to speak more. Eve requires tests. Eve? Female's real name unknown. Normandy, a human vessel. Human mythology seemed appropriate under circumstances. <laughs>